So what makes me different than any other endocrinologist I've ever met? It's an interesting question. Unfortunately, I haven't met a lot of endocrinologists that think like me. There may be some out there. I hope there are. If there are, reach out to me, please. But I'm very functional in how I approach medicine. And I also love that I have this skill set of understanding hormones and understanding hormone metabolism. And by hormones, I mean all sorts of hormones, thyroid hormone, insulin, leptin, sex hormones, all the bone breakdown pathways with PTH and vitamin D, micronutrients in your gut, pituitary hormones, adrenal, cortisol, which is very important. And so I have this background of knowledge with how all the hormones in our body work and how they all play a role together. And then I use that in addition to knowing that there's a lot of inflammation and just a very functional approach to trying to help my patients get better. A lot of the endocrinologists that I've met and what I learned in school was to treat people with medicine and to do it based on numbers because endocrinologists are very number based, very number lab heavy based specialty because we are looking at all this data. We're looking at all these different hormones. And so we're taught, okay, look at all those hormones, put them together, make sure they're all normal and then go on with yourself. And so unless you really, as an endocrinologist, start realizing that when you do that and you put everyone in these normal boxes, they still don't feel well. And you have the want or desire to say, man, this is not fulfilling. I really want my patients to feel better. Let's think about this. And then you go do a lot of research on your own. It's just difficult because what they teach us in, in fellowship is, is not that. And I feel like I went to a really good fellowship and I did a lot of clinical trials and it was very, you know, medication based. Like you treat diseases with medications and you use medications to prevent worsening of diseases. And so that's what we learned. That's doctors in general, providers in general, no matter where you're trained. But I didn't like that answer. I don't, I didn't like that my patients weren't getting better. I didn't like that. I felt like I was giving them more and more medication. So I think that what sets me apart from a lot of other endocrinologists that I've met or just providers in general is I don't keep people in those little boxes. And I do a lot, like I continue to learn every day. I was learning yesterday for five hours. I learned this morning before we started doing content. Like I'm always looking for the newest research and the newest data so that I can help people feel better. I think the other thing that sets me apart from other providers and endocrinologists is I was that patient too. Like I was that person who didn't feel well and who, you know, said, even though my numbers look great, I'm not feeling well. And so I've been in that role as a patient as well. And then I've been on the provider side. So I've seen both sides of it. And I think that just gives me the drive to keep looking and keep trying to help people. And I am very passionate about wanting you to just feel your best and figuring out how to do that. Like I'm willing to dig deep. I'm willing to do research. I'm willing to try to do all the testing to help you. Now you have to help yourself as a patient. Like there are certain things you have to do, but if you're willing to do that, I'm willing to put into the work and keep looking and keep trying to figure out ways to make you feel better. So I guess that's how I'm different than other endocrinologists that I've met.